back. So let's get to it today. I am on. So let's, um, today's uh, week three, and we're going to start starting with a alternating um, step up, um, one leg step up, and then an alternating step up. I'm going to be nice today for the simple fact is my setup here. I have both of my stools um, for my setup. So today will be light. Tomorrow, um, or later today's class will be different because I will find a different stool for this for this light right here. But for now, you guys are going to have a light step up. And for those of you that don't have a true step, the uh, chair is going to suffice today. Um, anything that you have around the house that you can tap step on and that can bear your weight. So that's what you're going to be doing today. So let's get started. We're going to start off from the beginning, which is our bag um, lunges and then our bag burpee and all of that. So let's start off with that. Guys, get your water. It's warm today. Uh, get your towel because you're going to be dripping sweat. And let's run through this entire thing in 30 minutes. Come on, guys, let's do it. So grab your bag. Or anything that you can press down on, large pillow, side of the couch. It doesn't have to be a bag. However, these are really inexpensive now and they're plentiful. When the pandemic first started, you know, you couldn't get any gym equipment. You could not find gym equipment for nothing. But now you can get it. All right. So we're going to start off with our uh, modified burpee push-up. All right. And then we're going to move on to everything else that we've been doing. And I'm going to take it. We're going to be consistent. I'm going to be, I'm not going to be going cadence or anything like that today, guys. We're just going to be at tempo and just keep your tempo. All right. It's going to be hard the first two exercises because your body's going to be getting used to it. We got to push on because we're at week three right now. So the rest of this week three to week four, I am going to push you. All right. You ready? Let's get it. Pop down, push up, no jump, two, we got eight, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, let's go for 10, nine, 19. nice, 10 seconds recovery, we're going to step into the lunge, and 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're going to start off with the front lunge. Actually, let's start off with the back lunge because that's a little jarring. Let's get that leg built up a little bit so we can make it smooth. It's a lot easier in the back lunge. So standing in front of it, just like that, coming back, shallow one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. My leg wobbly from yesterday's ride. I only did about 15 miles, but which is super duper weak. But I'm paying for it a little bit. I had quite a few heels though. I'm kicking my own butt right now, making myself do heels three days a week, possibly four. I want to get to seven. But right now I'm gonna do three. Absolutely probably gonna end up with four. But uh I got to get to seven days a week. I got to be on that bike seven days a week if I'm going to hit the, um, the trails at the end of July. Just not in good enough shape for it. I will kill myself. The heat, the altitude change, I will die. All right, let's go. So I got to get myself prepared. One, two, three, four. That was 
week. Four. I don't count that one. Five. Six. Seven. Come on. Got those two out of the way. Get rid of your bag. Now you have a standing curl. You're gonna need all this equipment though. Slide it out of the way. Now, hopefully you got your anchor going on. You got your door tied off because now we're gonna get into our curl. Our curl is next. Grab your bands. Walk it up. All right, feet together. I like to play the balance game when I'm doing my curls. And let's crank out 20 of these bad boys. Let's go. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Bands, I think we believe that we have, hold on one second, you're gonna have another 30 second recovery here. Oh my God, what is going on? All right, so let's go. Um, Um, all right, so we're at ball slams and then we go into our step up. So we're moving along almost too fast right now. <laughs> we're ahead of the game. So that might mean we might get in too. All right, so get your um, ball. This is the only piece of equipment that is not gonna be um, something that I can substitute out in the house. I did say that if you had a basketball or something like that, deflate it a little bit and then you can get the same somewhat effect. However, you're not gonna have to wait. So again, this is a 15 pound slam ball. They go down to five and they go up to 25. They don't, I don't think they see 25, but 15 to 10 pounds should be about good enough for us to start to, to begin. So we got 20 of these bad boys. Note at the 10, 10 mark, I'm gonna start picking it up differently. The first 10, I'm gonna be slamming with my entire body. Second 10, I'm just gonna be using my legs to pick up the ball and then my upper body to slam it. Right now, first 10, entire body. So you'll note, watch my body work. I'll give you a side view. Entire body, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. I can feel that in my calves. All right. Now, let's get into the next 10. Note that my arms are gonna come up a lot higher here. And I'm gonna be working through my upper body a lot more. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. 
Yes. It also has a lot to do with forearm strength. All right, get your ball out of the way. Now we're gonna come, we're gonna go into our next segment because I don't wanna go seated just yet. So, um, all right. So let's go into our step up. If this one, I hope I don't have no bad stains going on on this thing because I'm gonna take this off. I'm gonna take my cover off. I sit on this thing. I'm gonna take the cover off. And I'm just gonna use just that because I'm gonna put my foot on it. And I don't wanna put my foot on my nice stuff. All right. So now we got a step up, single leg step up, meaning that one leg just steps up one, two, three, all right? And then we're gonna do alternating, coming up, step up, that's just a tap. We're gonna do alternating, so a step up is here, one, two, or you can just keep it in the foot here. I prefer you keep it here, it's a little bit more engaged, all right, and this has a lot of give on it. You'll see when I do the next one, it's not gonna have, I'm not gonna use this stool, but just for now, because I don't want to change the setup, I want to keep it moving. So single leg step up, go ahead and bring that leg up onto the stool, right? And we're going to tap for 10. Make sure you got enough room for that other foot to tap once it gets up there, when it lands. And let's go for 10. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. Two, one. Thank God I do have tomorrow off for my legs, uh, upper body. Whew. But I don't know, I might not give them a break. All right, let's go 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Four, three, two, one. That feel good. I need all that activation. Now we have alternating. We're going to do alternating for 20 because that was a, a solid 10 on each. When we're alternating, if we do an alternate, we're only going to get five on each leg if we do 10. So 10 is 20. All right, let's go. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Get your stool out of the way. Grab your bag. You got another 10 seconds. Let's run through everything one more time. We're gonna cut everything in half. So everything is gonna be 10 to the 20. And if it's 20, it's gonna be 10. I said that, it sounded like the same thing, but it's actually not. All right, ready? Full body burpee. And Let's go. One. One, two. <clears throat> One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Four, five, one, two, 
three, four, five, six. Eight, we're not gonna break. We killed the legs, we gotta kill the upper body. Eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, soldier it out. You got nine. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah. You're going to finish this, baby. Last one, you got 10. All the way through. Let's go. Done. All right, upper body work. Last one is going to be our curls. We're going to finish off with the curls and then we're going to take it to our stretch. Grab your bands. And even if you don't have bands, guys, you can be doing this with a free weight just to let share with you, all right? Walk it out. Bring those feet together. Stick that chest out, line them up. Make sure you're lined up and let's crank out 20. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, Hydrate, and then we're going to take it to our stretch. All right. <clears throat> now, Let's take it to our stretch. Hopefully you're nice and warm by now. I know I am. Body's warm, core's warm, arms, chest, back, shoulders, hamstrings, legs, hamstrings, quads, calves, complete, total, full body. All right, guys, let's cross that front foot, just like so. Bring that back foot back, walk it back. You're gonna feel that hip, twist with it. Come on down. As you come forward, that back heel drops. Nice stretch for 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Hands to the mat, round the back, pull the head in, bend that front knee slightly so it's not engaged for 20, 19, 
18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. I've been really focusing on that hamstring a lot more because I've been doing a lot of back work and substituting my hamstring for that. And was getting major results when we were really focused on that hamstring for like two months. Start to let it go and got to always come back to it. It's so easy to forget and start thinking, oh, my back is tight. It's not the back. Even me as a professional, I forget. All right. Sometimes yoga doesn't address exactly what you need. So you just got to go into sports stretch. And 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Hands on the mat, round that back, bend that front knee for 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I know I'm doing something right because those hamstrings be shaking. All right. And let's come down, feet apart, and deep cleansing breath in, and bend at the knees. Come all the way down if you can. This would be prayer three. Just let all that pressure ease down that back for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and one. All right. Come on up. And let's feet together. Nice round back. Come up nice and slow vertebrae. Our vertebrae. Feet wide. Push that pelvis forward. And back. Push it forward. And back. Push it forward. Let the head go. One arm. Other arm. And twist. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. That was a real pump right there. We gotta stay on this level. Make sure you eat your Wheaties, take your vitamins, drink your water, and we will stay there. That's Milan signing out, see you soon.